taboo because it's Halloween. <laughs> Hello, everyone. <coughs> Got something stuck in my throat. It is almost Halloween when I upload this, which means let's do a not Halloween related video. The Halloween relation in this video is my makeup. As you can see, I went for a little bit of a spooky vibe, babes. If you want to get Halloween, maybe you should just check out my Instagram because this is full of Halloween looks right now, probably. Maybe just one. But that's more than none. Guys, I think it's just been some time since I've tried something on without knowing what I ordered. Did I ever do that? Let's rewind back some time. <coughs> that was the rewinding time sound effect. It's for free, no lessons to be bought. <coughs> so I discovered this website, liquidation.com, a couple of weeks, months ago. I actually bought Amazon returns on that website. It's basically like eBay a little bit. You can just bid on stuff and then obviously maybe win it if you have the highest bid. I couldn't actually tell you the difference to eBay. I think it's more commercial, more on the business side than eBay because I feel like eBay is very like private person. I kind of really like this website because they have so much stuff and so much stuff that I want to have and want to try in a video. The only bad thing is it is an American website so I do have a couple of issues just getting the stuff from there because they just shipped to America but you know I figured out a way to do it. I was thinking what else can I get there because I feel like you can be very lucky and get some good stuff for not a lot of money or you can be not very lucky like I was when I ordered the Amazon returns. <laughs> I'm using chili as a laptop holder. <laughs> what is this? Oh the good boy look at this little good boy. So I actually found an interesting auction of just formal dresses. I mean, why am I saying just? It's formal dresses, which means it's like, you know, like prom dresses kind of. Actually, no, it says designer formal dresses. It's very mysterious. I'm not sure if I'm getting what I, I see on these pictures because I've seen this exact auction a lot of times on liquidation with the same picture. So I feel like they're just placeholders. I actually already won a bid on formal dresses like a month ago and I actually forgot to make the payment for this so I got blocked. <laughs> My whole account just got deleted and then I had to pay $200 for it in order to be reactivated. What the fuck? Now I have this one and I'm very happy. I actually won this auction with a price of 299 US dollars. Of course in the end I paid much more because shipping costs then again shipping costs from America to Germany. I paid a total of 388 dollars which is about 400 euros. Oh actually I think the dollar is actually the same as euros right now which is kind of crazy because I feel like we're gonna die. I actually have 10 pre-owned juniors and women's formal and semi-formal dresses styled similar to those in the photos. We'll see how similar that is gonna be. Highlights may include a few of the following brands. David's Bridal, Jessica McClintock, <laughs> Adriana Papel, <laughs> Liz Claiborne Knight, Calvin Klein, I know this bitch. Boutique brands, variety of colors included. Perfect for wedding, bridesmaid, porn, homecoming, kinse what? quinceanera, quinceanera, they said. I actually have bought a total of 10 dresses and I also do not know what sizes these are. So let's just hope they're gonna fit me because I think there can be anything in there from size 0 to 100. I don't know US sizes but you get the point. So let's have a look at my dresses. I'm not wearing pants. This is my package everyone! There could be my future wedding dress in there by Jessica Papel. Ralph Lauren? Do we stand Ralph Lauren or is she cancelled? <gasps> oh my god. Oh, it's all in one huge bag. <gasps> Honestly, guys, I have no idea in what condition these dresses are gonna be as they are returns and not even the manifest said anything about what condition they are in. Oh. <laughs> Time for the first outfit. Hä? Das Kleid hat keinen Zipper. Boah, das riecht nach alten Sofakissen. Wait, <laughs> is that the worst? Guys, 
this is my Ralph Lauren dress. We got a little slit. I think this is not too bad for my first one. I mean, let's be honest, I would not wear this to any occasion probably, but I still think this is not a horrendous dress because it kind of fits quite well and it's kind of cute with all the little sequins that are just popping up when I move. I mean, if you just think this a little more, you know. But what do you want to adjust? I don't know about the off shoulder. <laughs> Chili! I'm trying to be sexy! But not too bad for the first dress. I don't mind Ralph Lauren. I'm actually just more surprised that it actually fits. <laughs> I'm not wearing anything anymore, but I just have to say the tag tells me that this was $210 in original price. So it's actually quite an expensive dress. Let's carry on. Time for the next outfit. <laughs> What do we think of this one? <laughs> Obviously, it's just a bit too big. I think this is like a size 16. And the designer is actually Catherine Lindsay. Do we know her? Honestly, I feel like if, you know, I'm wearing maybe a little corset. Now it's getting kind of <laughs> intense. It's cute now. It's cute now besides the entire <laughs> Maybe, maybe you have to take it, take it off. Put it in your bra. You take this and put this in your bra as well. You just want to stuff the whole dress into my bra. And then, wow, this looks so fantastic. <laughs> Aphrodite <laughs> in the smiley. Fantastic. Wonderful. I actually don't know how much this was. There's no price tag in there. I think I'm gonna put on the next one. The uh, next outfit. <sighs> so far, we're not doing so good. Honestly, without this, it would kind of be cute. To be quite fair, it fits perfectly. Honestly, just ignore this part. As long as we do not look there and just look everywhere else but not on this spot, the dress looks absolutely good. Vincent, do you think I should just rip this all off? But I also don't like the bottom. I don't mind the bottom, actually. Can you look what brand this is? Ra Rando Randy. It's Ran in <laughs> No. Len <laughs> <laughs> Lauren Dory. Guys, we figured the designer is Lauren Dory. Are you my word? It's Lauren Dory. <laughs> I feel gorgeous. <laughs> Guys, I think this is my favorite dress so far. And if we take this off, I think I could actually wear this on a family party. We can't figure out the brand. Let me know if you know what it is or if we were actually right, maybe. Kiwi. Berry. I think it's time for the next one. Positive note, I feel like this one looks really good with my makeup. This is giving Halloween Tinkerbell. What do I do as Halloween Tinkerbell? Fly, but then be bad. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll do your laugh. <gasps> I think we got that in the bag. And Taylor. Taylor Swift. And now write your name. Boys, only one love when it's Torture. Guys, this is the first dress that actually does not fit. Oh, it's Fashion Nova. <laughs> Designer former dress is my ass. Guys, I'm sorry, I lied. Actually fits. This is the Khaleesi dress. Do I look Khaleesi to you? I think many people will like this dress, actually. I think it's very flattering as well. It looks cute, pretty, can be dressed up as well. Start working at Fashion Nova then. <laughs> I was promised Calvin Klein and Jessica Petutu. Breaker of chains, mother of dragons, and queen of Fashion Nova. <laughs> I hate to say, but it's the prettiest dress out of all. Yeah, it probably is, but it's also Fashion Nova. It's probably 20 euros, and it's probably also Fashion Nova. That's 
a rough one. <laughs> That's Berlin. That is literally just elderly woman go shopping at Macy's. I feel like the thrift store of vintage girlies can make it work. They can make everything work. I mean, give me a corset, baby. I think I'm just having trouble with this. And it's very long. We actually have a very long dress. I feel very free in this one. actually the business walk dress not more not less business walk dress not more not less business walk dress not more not less this is actually the designer Jessica Howard. I don't know her and I don't think I want to get to know her. This is not my favorite, but I like the color and it's maybe a little big. Maybe that's also an issue. Maybe it should also be tighter. We maybe need Vincent the tight designer in here. Tight designer, the tighter, but apparently he's busy. <laughs> <laughs> not more? <laughs> the next outfit. Kinda right? This really gives me actual prom dress vibe, but not like prom, but halfway there prom, what we had in eighth grade. But I don't think I would've worn such a bright color because I was not that confident. Oh, by the way guys, you didn't even see, but it's short. I wanna run It really also kinda reminds me of old Naomi. I like this. We don't know what label, what brand this is. Unless one of you knows what brand this is. Ooh. I have nothing else to say about this dress other than it's really cute. It fits perfectly, but I would probably not wear it because it's just too cute for me. <laughs> because I'm actually the opposite of cute. Let's try the next one. The next outfit. I feel like we're just not getting better. I think this might actually be one of the worst ones. Also can't close it. And maybe I can close it, but it's really hard to. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh, oh, oh. This was so nice to close it. <laughs> Howie. I think this brand is called After Six and it kind of sounds to me like a very Fashion Nova shop somehow. Not designer. Can you Google it real quick? Vincent says After Six seems to be a wedding dress brand, as you can see. <laughs> Oh, I hate everything about this. I think there's also something that was attached on the sides because there's a little bit of thread hanging here. I just hate how this whole top looks. What the fuck is this? It's not flattering. I don't like the color. Everything about this is just horrendous. It's okay. Vincent thinks it's okay, but he's definitely lying. I'll go get this off because it also really pokes my back rolls. I actually don't mind this one. It's kind of cute. It's giving romantic comedy girl woman goes on a date. <gasps> ah. oh, today's the day and I really don't know if I should be doing this. I could be doing so many other things. For example, watch the fifth episode of Friends. <laughs> You're in a hurry. You gotta be like. This is dangerous. Don't do it with the I'm scissors. brushing my teeth. I know, but not with the scissors. Anyway, you're putting on your shoe and the naked you're also tying your dress, and you're also on your phone with your girlfriend, and like he's this really hot dude. That's what you gotta do now. Okay. Do your job. Jennifer, I really gotta go. I'm five hours late already, and I still have not worn any shoe on my feet because I'm having a phone call with them. Wait, that's the wrong door. Oh. Why am I holding a knife? I can't get this dress on. I think I just ate too many muffins. <laughs> this is the dress. <laughs> what do you guys think of this dress? I think it actually is the best one out of all of them so far. You probably don't like this area, I know. But I don't see it. I just see this. <laughs> Let's hope it's from Gucci. <laughs> Listen. Impression. Yes, I really like this. Even though I have no idea how much it is. But if it says Impression Bridal, it's probably... I think I'm gonna try the last one now. Vincent, I think I'm just gonna say I ordered only nine dresses. <laughs> <laughs> it 
sense. It's not that bad. I thought this was gonna look worse when I got it out of the packaging. Now that you tied me up a little bit, I don't mind it that much. Yeah, it's giving 2000 era glow up, right? Yes, like Cinderella story mm -hmm. kind of movie. Mm -hmm. Yes, hello, Jeff. I love you. Oh, I love you too. I don't know if you can see this, but I actually got two tall skirts in here. Or actually just one. <laughs> I cannot count. Taco, get away from me. This is my moment. Obviously, it's also kind of ugly, but I get what Vincent means. It kind of makes you a little bit emotional. I think this would have been exactly what I wanted to wear if I had my Cinderella moment back in time. I just think it's a very, very noisy dress. I feel like this is literally the only dress that gives me what I thought I was gonna give, get out of this package. Like a formal dress. I know they're all kind of formal, but I've expected a bit more, to be honest. Has nobody brand on? Hey, Jane Scott? That's a lot of names. Vincent looked up the brand. Uh, apparently you can get it at Peak and Kloppenburg. <laughs> And it's gonna be around the price range of seventy, a hundred dollars, maybe. <gasps> Vincent, you filthy liar! Filthy, filthy liar! This is two hundred and nineteen dollars. You sold me for less than I am worth. But this is also from two thousand and two. So these were all of my 10 formal dresses that I ordered from Liquidation. I don't know what I expected, but as I said, I did expect a bit more, apparently. When it comes to how pretty these dresses are, um, you can judge for yourself. I do not like many of these, but I also don't think they're horrendous. I think there are people out there who could actually like them. So I actually wanna ask you if you wanna have them. My last prom dresses, I was able to give away to like a youth center of like young girls and boys. I actually don't know, it's just young people. So if you maybe have an occasion where you would need one of these or two of these or whatever of these prom dresses for and you actually think they're pretty, I will send them to you. For me personally, I do not have any interest of keeping any of these. They're really not my style, except maybe the purple one I tried before this one. But that was also the fun of this video. I think it was very fun to just let it surprise me, even though there were many dresses that I did not like. <laughs> but I like the thrill of it. it. Kind of gave me an adrenaline shot. Let me know if I should order something else from Liquidation because they have a lot. Something is in my dress. An imposter. Where is this? Exposed bitch. Okay. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social media which is Naomi John on. Instagram. <laughs> Naomi John on. And the Naomi John on. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. And now we're gonna sing our song at the end. Not more? Not more. Now let's, let's. the business walk dress. <laughs> I think this one's falling asleep.